Hello, my name is Gail Morton, and I'm going to show you how to find psychology resources. Now we're going to go to the main page of the library, libraries.mercer.edu. Once I'm here, I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to go to research guides and tutorials. And I'm going to see all the subjects here. We're going to find psychology. There it is. And psychology. And here are databases that are specific to psychology. So I'm going to look at um, psych articles from EBSCO. EBSCO is a company that provides databases. You can see one above at this ProQuest that provides this database. And I'm going to start with EBSCO. Okay, and I'm going to do a very simple search. Let's do mental health resources and college students. And again, it's a very basic search. I put the AND between here to connect my search terms together. So I want to see this search term, terms, these search terms. And it's coming, it takes a minute sometimes. Alright. And here's my results. I got, I have a total of 13 results. I'm going to click on one. Number two is fine. PDF full text. Okay, and this is the article. I can download it here. If I click here, the PDF is saved to my desktop. I'm going to draw your attention to the side here. I put it in Google Drive, I can print it, I can email it, um, I can add it to a folder. This is the one that I really want to point out. This is the site tool. And there's a bunch of different citation formats. And since it's psychology, most of your papers will be in APA. And here it is, and you can copy and paste this into your paper. Now not all of it is 100% right. Like the information is here, but the format might be wrong. So put it in there, but be mindful it might be wrong. You can also have your citations checked by a librarian. If you send your paper in to me, I will look at your citations and make any kind of adjustments, or I can teach you how to do it. Okay. So that's using EBSCO Psych Articles. There's something else I want to show you, too. Okay, so we can link to full text, and there's an impact statement, it tells you how good the journal is. Open access, which is, um, it's freely available for everyone. Okay, and over here, this is something that you're going to need for your college classes, peer review journals. All journals, they're 13, but peer review journals. Okay, and a peer review is, let's just say that someone in your field, like your psychology professor wrote a paper, sent it into a psychology journal. A bunch of editors that also have their PhDs in psychology read it and okayed it, and then they can publish it in that journal. So since there are only 13, and it looks like all of them are peer-reviewed, we don't need to click the box. I can limit it even more. Age gender, classification, methodology. Test and measures is something that you might. And so you can see here, out of these, this one looks safe, we can do that. So in this article is a traumatic stress test. Okay, 
and that's how you do a very simple search in EBSCOhost uh, psych articles.